So let's get to it and build your course file in Unity since your scene is all set and ready to go. So here we are. Um, this is Hershey Country Club. So it probably looks a lot different from any other videos you might have seen this. It is, I'd say it's 90% done. There's still a few things I have to get going here, but for the most part, it's done. So I'm getting ready and I'm going to build this so I can uh, take it into Greenkeeper. So how do we do that? <clears throat> well, first of all, let's take a look at your scene name. Um, this, the standards for the scene name has changed over time. So there might be some old videos out there. The bottom line is we want this format to be um, like the name of your course. It doesn't have to be the complete name, just something that this is Hershey Country Club. Um, and this says underscore V1 underscore GSP. Uh, we want to simplify this. So we can just come up here and it could just say file, save scene as and we want it to uh, let's put it back in our terrain backup for the, this existing one this is our existing scene right here and let's just name it instead of the v1 let's take the v1 out so that standard that we want now is the name of the course underscore gsp and you'll see there's a unity extension after this now what's going to happen is our build script is going to build a unity game file and then the build script is also going to encrypt it. The reason we encrypt it is for a couple of reasons. One is the OPCD tools are, well, they've taken a lot of time. And if they're not encrypted, someone could potentially steal those or use those. And of course, that would violate the EULA. Um, but we want to protect those. The second thing is you want to protect your work. Um, if you don't encrypt this and it's just a regular Unity file, someone could potentially take that, use it, and for you know some other reasons maybe another a competitor to gs pro the bottom line is this will get encrypted okay so let's save this hershey country club underscore gsp unity and when we do that you'll see here the name will change give it a second and now there we got okay so this is the name when we build our course it's going to create a folder with that name and it's going to create a encrypted uni file with that same name. So let's go ahead and kick this off. So back up here to GSP, I believe. Yep. So under the GSP menu, build course. And you're going to see in here, uh, first of all, uh, a couple things. One is it's going to give you a location where you can save your course. So you want to change this to someplace where you, I typically want to put it in my OPCD folder. So I put mine in my D drive. If you remember way back when I told you how to organize your folders, I got my OPC projects, I got Hershey Country Club, and I'm just gonna put it in here, okay? And it's gonna create a folder. Remember, this folder is gonna be called Hershey Country Club underscore GSP. I'm gonna select that folder. Um, and then I have to select my scene file. I'm gonna hit browse, and you can see here's the old one, but here's the new one right here double click on it now it shows up and you have the option now of disabling foliage on your terrain collider you can leave that check remember i referred to that earlier or you can do it manually uh, if you want you could always disable it manually in your foliage train uh, just remember that it just does disable it so if you come back and you try to plant things on your foliage train and you can't it's because your terrain collider got disabled so you know you need to go back into your terrain your foliage train and enable that collider again okay after you do this so now i'm going to hit build and at this point you want to go get a cup of coffee okay this is going to take depending on the speed of your computer probably anywhere between 10 and 20 minutes however if you're doing this for the very first time you've only built a hole or two then it might take significantly less than that so i'm going to pause the video Okay, that finished, and let's go look at the course uh, file that it created. So let me go to my file explorer, and I am in my OPCD project, Hershey Country Club, and right here, uh, oops, I got to refresh this. Oh, no, it's right down here. Go up up there, and then back in, it'll be, yeah, Hershey Country Club underscore GSP. Remember, it creates a folder for us, and then inside that, here is our course file. So Hershey Country Club underscore GSP dot, notice this is not a Unity file anymore, it's a GSP CRSE, that is GSP, I'm not sure what the CRS, but it's an encrypted Unity file now. And it is pretty big, it's uh, 149 meg, almost a gig. 
At this point, this is your course in the form of a game file that can be used inside of, well, almost used inside of GS Pro. Next step here is to go into Greenkeeper and Greenkeeper is going to leverage this file and you're gonna place your, P your T's, your pins, your out of bounds, your hazards, your course information and all that good stuff. So go get it.